Hello, perceptive readers. This is James. I want to talk very briefly about your process of whether it's business or even getting to uh, know somebody or how you go about your routine to gain resources. Let's say, as you know, uh, you know what you want. However, there are different uh, trials and other types of processes in place that may take time for you to acquire this resource or that resource. Now, the important thing that I want you to remember about what you're trying to do in life, your profession, uh, your family, uh, your resources, or what have you, remember when it comes to advice, uh, you have to take certain advice with a grain of salt, especially if it is from anyone who hasn't really even um, uh, reached out to help you otherwise than just really word of mouth types of, you know, statements. I'm just saying that um, as a matter of fact. And in, in, in along with that, going along with that, remember, if you already have a business plan, even with individuals uh, that you have in mind who you are going to use, you see, you got to sometimes put aside uh, the personality aspect of things because if this person, if you're looking at this person as like a vendor of good things, because you're probably looking at yourself like that. <laughs> I told you that's how entrepreneurs have a tendency to look at themselves. Uh, but the same thing, even the resource that you're looking at, uh, you know, I always say again, you don't have to go too much into looking into somebody, um, you know, else's life or business when all you're doing is saying, I'm buying this loaf of bread from you. I am purchasing uh, this skill from you. Now, wh whatever you do again, you know, use the expression on, on Friday night, uh, that's your business. And the only time you see uh, there may require uh, more conversation is depending on whether you want whatever you're doing uh, linked with that person's uh, outside activities or what have you. And, you know, and I always uh, say again, you, if you're a vendor and you're a, a grocery store, so to speak, you are actually serving to everybody. Everybody will walk in that store, no matter what their different belief systems is, what type of personality they have, or what have you. It's like it's just a transaction, and there you go. Well, it's the same thing if, let's say, you're going to an artist for something, uh, and you know the art, the, the person that got what you're looking for, and so you use their resources, and it's just that you see. No it's and buts about it. Otherwise, it's like this is why I, you know, uh, I've come to you for this. You see, now I always say again, if there are additional services that you may uh, want or need uh, for me, then maybe we can talk about it. I can schedule this or what have you. But anything more than that, oh, you better believe it's going to be more in a uh, well drawn up, thought out uh, manner of correspondence. So I just wanted to keep, uh, you to keep that in mind that no matter what you hear as far as advice, sometimes that advice is coming from persons that just want that same resource that you know you have acquired or that you're actually once again um, developing or what have you. And they'll try to do and say things for you to stop using that resource. Why? Because quite possibly, sometimes your competitors just want that resource for themselves. And that is a fact. That is very much a fact. And I just want you to know that. So for any of you who know that um, I've actually corresponded or, or if it wasn't in writing or if it was uh, vocally or what have you, uh, just know uh, sometimes I might go to this resource or that resource, and hey, uh, uh, the resource may not say they have time for it, you know, right now or what have you. And so, you know, I, I move on. You may uh, do the same thing, but it doesn't mean that maybe sometime in the future that I might come around again. Uh, and see, and that's what we do. We just let people do what they need to do 
uh, for their business uh, and their profession and, of course, their family. You have a very nice day. Take care of yourself. You have just listened to the Perceptive Readers Podcast. Remember, until next time, if you read something that encourages you to improve or enhance your life for the better, it becomes your reality.